because I, I started to think and I started to wonder, you know what? It, it, it is about time for us to get up out of Lodabar. It, it's about time for us to be like Mephibosheth. Then basically what Mephibosheth, when he was five years old, he was a boy. And what happened was that his family was under attack. So what they did was they started carrying him because he was small. And then when they dropped him, they broke his feet. And when they broke his feet, he was no longer able to walk on his own. So from that point forward, somebody always had to carry him. So then he went from being five years old to ten years old. He went from being ten years old to a teenager. He went from being a teenager to an adult. And all this time, because of what happened to him as a child, he was crippled for the rest of his life. And this is what I'm afraid of. I'm afraid of the fact that, listen, they put these bars around here to keep us locked in, but pastor's here to help us break up out of this piece. Because if we're not careful, what's going to happen is, is that apartment is going to turn out to be your coffin, and this campus is going to turn around and be your graveyard. And listen to me, God has more in store for you. Is there anybody in here who believes that God, God's got more in store for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. See, see, I understand that once you get this word on the inside of you, it will keep you motivated when you feel like giving up. It will keep you focused when it seems like you're getting distracted. This word will keep you convicted when it feels like you're losing control. Is there any?